hello. We are on our way to Corwinna Park in Idledale, Colorado. That's a small town in between Evergreen and Morrison. It's about 25-30 minutes from Denver. We are going to be doing the Panorama Point Trail to Bear Creek Trail, which is a loop. Here we are turning down this small road going over this one-way bridge to the parking lot. This is going to be a 3.1 mile hike, about 643 feet of elevation gain. Beautiful spring day. This is already a very shaded trail, which is really nice. And we're following a creek. There's a helicopter hovering around. But this is a very thin trail to start out with. rocks. We have this little creek. So this is like a little park with a couple of different trails. People go mountain biking here as well. Um, it's near the town of Evergreen. It's in the town of Idledale. It's very close to Morrison, Colorado as well. Um, so it's kind of close to Denver, not too far into the mountains. But it's a very popular park. There are um, very limited parking spots. It's, there is a parking lot, but it gets full even during the week. So the weekend, unless you get here very early in the morning, like seven, I wouldn't even try it because the park rangers give out parking tickets too if you're not in a parking spot. And there is one handicapped spot and then just a few regular parking spots. So space is limited.
Sorry about the helicopter noise. I don't know if there's an accident on 70 or what, but it keeps coming back. This is such a beautiful trail. Like I said, it's very popular. This is a Wednesday and I've already passed like five people on the trail. Um, but so far, so beautiful. You have rocks, lots of shade, and we're still following the creek. There are lots of rocks here, very shaded. This is the way we just came. Still following this beautiful babbling creek. And this is a Wednesday morning. We did come a little bit later than I normally do. It's 10 in the morning. Um, but I have passed about five people on the trail already, so pretty popular. Still on the first part of the trail. It is pretty steep and they do have these nice little steps a couple of times already on the trail. So that makes it easier to climb up. We're still on the first leg of the trail. There's so many little alcoves where you can have some little creek play. And it's very shaded back here. Um, you're in like this little valley. It goes up here and then up here and you're kind of walking in between. Um, so you're kind of protected from the wind and the sun. There's the wildflowers are popping right now. So, so beautiful. Some more stairs. We have rock over here. So the trail has widened a bit, really about double the size now. Not as much of an elevation climb, we're about a half a mile in. We're not next to the creek any longer. I have passed a couple more people, so like I said, it is a very busy trail even during the week. We're gonna be coming up to the fork in just a moment. So we're coming up to our first junction Penorma, Penorama Point Trail. This way um, to the right is where bikes can go. This way is just hikers. And so we're gonna start climbing again. And we're going to get some amazing views of Mount Blue Sky. We are in a not so shaded part and it's definitely warm. It's like in the seventies and no clouds in the sky. So feeling the heat today. Okay, so second junction is not far from the first. We are doing the Pananor Panorama Point Trail. I cannot say that word. So we just came from here. This is where the loop starts. So you can go left and go straight. To the right is Bear Creek Trail, and that's more mountain bikers. So we're gonna go up 
this way. This is where the loop starts. You go all the way up to the top, you see great views, and then you come back down, we end up here. It's pretty windy today, but it feels good in the shade because we are very warm today. Excited to see those views though. We just climbed quite a bit. There's some wildflowers right here. And this is our first view of Mount Blue Sky. It's very windy. That wind feels so good though. It's very warm today. Um, so this is our first spot where we can see Mount Blue Sky and um, it's only gonna get better from here. It's just the very top is all white and it's very cool. Like I said, I've passed even more people on the trail, so very busy on a Wednesday morning. So I just climbed quite a bit. This is probably the best view. You have this little lookout point here where you can have snacks or a sip of water or picnic. We just came from down there. The trail still goes up to the top and then back down. Well, here's Mount Blue Sky. So windy today, but take it. This is the warmest we've been on a hike so far. get over these views, like the whole climb. So incredible. Snack on the go. Full on toddler mode now. Okay. 
So we're at the top of the mountain now. And what's cool is we have Mount Blue Sky views here. I'm not sure what this mountain is, but it's also White Peaks. And then right over this mound here is views of Denver. So really amazing views on this hike. Definitely a climb, but doable and lots of spots to stop, which is nice. And this is like what they call Panorama Point, which is like the peak view of the mountains. Let's see. And then you also get a view of the town of Idledale, which is really small. Apologize for the wind. from very cool so we are now at the halfway point we are now descending we are at a little fork in the road so panorama point trail is where we just came and now we're doing the Bear Creek to go on the other side of the loop. We are 1.5 miles in, and now we're gonna head down to the other side of the loop, and now we are descending. So no more climbing, yay. And now this way, we have a, mount, a view of Mount Blue Sky the whole way down, so should be pretty nice. It is so warm, it's now like 11.15 in the morning and normally we are done by our hikes by this time, but we're just halfway through this one and it is warm. This is why we normally go at like 8.30 in the morning. definitely a different hike for us because my baby is just wanting snacks the whole time so I'm trying to keep them in the carrier and just pass some little snacks I'm doing the little these are just freeze-dried mango and basil and they're really tiny little pieces so I just give them one at a time it's still so windy lots of people on the trail lots of bikers too they are very considerate though and ring their bell, let me know that they're coming, let me know how many are in their party so I know how many are gonna be passing me. Um, so that's been good. But man, these views, the wind, this is a great trail. If you want a pretty moderate hike, not too long, but doable, um, hike with a view. This is it, and it's like 25 minutes from Denver, so really, really cool.
So we're two miles in, almost to the end of the loop, and then we go to the junction. That's the straight path to the parking lot. What a beautiful day. So many wildflowers, lots of rocks and big boulders. The view all the way down and up really has been incredible. Nice and warm. Feels like summer today, that's for sure. Okay, we are at the junction point of where the loop started. So parking lot is that way. Where we started the loop is that way. So we are going from Bear Creek Trail back onto Panorama Point Trail. Heading back to the parking lot. Yay! So we are definitely warm. Past, I would say, five or six bikes in the last 10 minutes or so. So, very, very busy trail. We're back to the narrow part of the trail. We're following the creek back to the parking lot. What a beautiful hike on a beautiful day. It's June 5th today. And it's definitely feeling just like a warm, springy, summery day. Lovely. Highly recommend this hike if you're anywhere in the Denver area. It's really, really beautiful. He's asleep, always, always happens at the end of a hike. End of the trail, back to the parking lot. I apologize, it's very loud here because there's still that helicopter swooping. I'm not sure what's going on near the highway. But anyway, that was an amazing hike. Um, very busy trail, but well worth it. Amazing views. Uh, we did 3.1 miles, 633 feet of elevation gain in about an hour and 50 minutes. So pretty great hike, very warm today. Um, so now we're just gonna have our snacks and then head home. Until next time.